I believe in the power of words and the impact an individual can have when they use the right words in the right context. I developed the ability to write songs in my head. I saw SKE the Heist Man write a song in his head. This is a cat I met in Long Island, my favorite rapper. I saw him write a song in his head and record it like it was nothing. From that day forward, I was just like, you know what, I'm right in my head. Good, how about yourself? Staying low. Are you ready for this? You did of a 27 course. last yeah. time. Yeah. She's what the I only do. rapper I know who would do this. One, two. This is Charles Hamilton. Should know that by now. If you don't, I really don't care. He was a very, very, very good freestyler. And, you know, he would send me music. So I heard a lot of his early FDA music. And I was like, this kid is incredible. I said, no one does and doesn't provoke him. What is the do that you do? I do what it do, but people can't make my musical moves. So basically, they're through. My movement is true, but it got intercepted by the mainstream again. So I'm taking them to the extreme end and then going to be their friend, befriend their end. Then before they reach the end, I'm going to be who they try to reach, the end. I'm a technical MC, so from a technical lyrical standpoint, he always was phonetically multi-syllabic. Multi I know how to twist these words, tossing out like 50 words, but only getting five back. Charles, you are the, wait, hold on, I miscounted all that. I remember going to visit him at FDA and I was just like blown away that, you know, he was able to live in the studio and make music there. And he played me so much music and I was just like, wow. We did the Double XL freshman cover together. We were the darlings of the internet at that time. It did feel like a golden ticket, like this was our way to our dreams. I met Charles at Harlem Live. They would do open mics. Where people could just go in, perform in front of a crowd and enjoy yourself. He saw that I was spitting to myself. He immediately just walked up to me. He was like, yo, would you spit? And we started a cypher. And that's what we've been doing since 2005. We could go back to back and I cocky swinging and you could get drop B. Wing it. <laughs> Until the day we swinging on Rocky for bringing <laughs> Harlem to its knees. I construct sentences when I write, especially when I write in my head. My verses are paragraphs, three paragraph essays. I can introduce you to the undertaker as the maker. What Charles does is he'll come up with an idea of what he wants and then he'll freestyle from there. the ring without a little interview, perhaps Dean Ambrose. Say, oh, I want to hit these points in my, in my rhyme. He might even like start the first couple bars off on some like, all right, I know pretty much what I'm going to say for the first couple. And then from there, I'm taking off. <laughs> Why do you do it? I'm not going to say how do you do it. I, I, know, I know where it comes from. At this barbecue, he comes by and he's like, yo, you're Halo. I'm like, yeah. <laughs> He's like, I gotta let you hear some stuff, I gotta let you hear some stuff. So he had his iPod, he threw the earphones and I hear some of his joints. So I'm like, yo, this dude actually, he's got like some skills. The way he was chopping stuff up and he had the same kind of ear for like certain sounds with the music that I did, it was like, oh nah, I gotta kind of F with this dude. He didn't write, he, he just freed it all. And that's what he does, you know what I'm saying? He's such a musician at heart. He can just go behind keys and bomb, go behind drums, bomb, good, guitar, bomb. Let alone a mic. Throw him in front of a mic, you know, you're gonna have to rip him off of it. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Taylor, great to meet you, bro. Charles is the type of dude who doesn't like the color inside the lines, so to speak. Like, you know, like, there's a certain set of rules that comes with, you know, being in the industry and, and being, you know, signed and all that. And whereas being an artist, you can adhere to those guidelines as well as do your own thing. Charles is more on the other side of doing his own thing than he is of the rule set, so to speak. Standing in a bonanza looking at the cannon. Damn, I can't stand my standards, but my man's in. He can do anything he wants. He's that talented. When you can play instruments and rap and freestyle and have these great concepts with songs, the sky is the limit. It's, it's all about how far he wants to take it.